It was a very slow crawl home from the city and I almost didn't stop off at the post office because I was quite tired and hot after two hours in the car. But I decided to stop and I am very happy I did because my package from eBay has arrived and I'm very excited to open it. This is a Mortensen math kit and it is supposed to have an old style carrying case in it. So I'm excited to see what that is like. I'm not quite sure I have to open this. I'm quite sure the best way to open it. Got my little knife here. Makes it easy. To try to kind of figure out which, which end I'm supposed to open. Perhaps I'm on the wrong. Kind of a dirty old box. I don't know if this is an original box or just some box they found. Okay. I'm getting somewhere. I think I'm opening it from the wrong side. Or something. I think I'll slide it out. Oh, okay, here we go. Oh, more packaging. It's like a really badly wrapped Christmas gift. I'm glad it's wrapped as well as it is because that means that it should all be intact when I open it. So I'm going to move that off to the side. And I don't want to cut through anything here. So that's why I'm being a little careful. I'm not very impressed by the wrapping and stuff that we used. It's very gross. I feel like I'm going to need ugh, a bit of a shower when I'm done. You really take your chances when you order on eBay, hey? Hopefully what's inside is clean. Okay, well this unboxing is definitely taking a turn. And here it is. I'm just gonna throw this in the garbage can. It's so gross. So here it is. This is the case that it comes in. Hmm. I'm thinking that it doesn't fit both of these. Okay, let's open it up and see what's inside. This is meant maybe for one of these. It doesn't seem like it actually. Yeah, okay, so it fits one tray. So here's the old style carrying case that I was curious about. I'm probably gonna throw that in the wash. Because it looks like it could use a bit of a wash, but it's not in bad shape. The zipper works well. And it looks, from what I can tell, as though you can put one one tray in. So here is the tray. This is the Mortensen math tray. This is the top layer. These are just two little um, measurement books that came with it. I've already got these so they're not really actually. I wonder if these are one of the ones that Kirk might need. I'll have to look. Anyways, these are pretty exciting. This is the kits. The Mortensen math kits. They have, um, it's an old style one because these are open. On the back, these are hundreds. And these ones here are smooth, they're x squareds. Anyways, let's look at the top tray because it'll give you a better idea what it's all about. You've got your units here, your ones, your twos, threes, fours, fives, six, seven, eight, nine, and then there's your tens and then your hundreds. And then if you turn your tens onto their side, they're smooth, and those can be your X's or your unknowns. They could be any um, letter that you want to um, use for algebra. Um, but when you start out with the kids, it's easy enough just to call them X's. And then um, these would be X by X, and the shape is a square, so X squareds. So you're able to actually do uh, a lot of work with these um, for algebra. So like you could, um, I'll just do a real quick one here. This is X squared. And you had 
1x, 2x, and 1. I'm sure you've all seen something like that in your math um, at high, in high school, x squared, 2x, and 1. And if you were asked to factor it, the easiest way to do it is just to form your blocks into a rectangle. In this case, it happens to be a special rectangle. It turns into a, uh, into a um, square. And then you just count the across and the up. So this is x plus one more across and x plus one more up. And so it's x plus one squared or x plus one times x plus one. You can even use um, this block model to um, graph x squared plus 2x plus 1. You can use it to graph um, multiple um, trinomials. Um, I'm not going to get into that obviously at the moment. I just wanted to unbox what I got in the mail and as you can see it's pretty cool. It, it, these don't look like they've really been used very much. They're in pretty good shape even though they are slightly um, maybe could use a quick quick wash in my sink maybe because they've just been laying around for a while but they're they're in really good shape they're not like dirty dirty they're just really dusty and uh, let's look at this carrying case again you can actually if I'm correct I think it only does put the one case in so you put that in and then do it up and then if you wanted to travel with it and you were working with kids you could just take your your top tray you know or you could take your bottom tray it really depend I don't know if the bottom tray would really fit in here I guess we could try but I really doubt it believe it or not I have a lot of these blocks the reason I bought this kit was actually for this carry case there's a lot of really old Morton's and math stuff that they have or had that is not around anymore today. So, yeah, I don't think it's meant for, I don't think it's meant for the big bottom tray. I think it's only meant for the top tray. Let's try it without that in. Well, I guess you could put the, the bottom tray in. This was just in the way. I didn't have it in proper. So you could put your bottom tray in as well. Um, but you can't, I don't think both will fit in there. That would be almost pushing it. So I think it's just for either the bottom or top tray. But this is actually why, why I bought it this here. Explore and discover Mortensen more than math. Um, obviously I love the blocks as well because I will use them, but I, I don't normally buy blocks on eBay anymore simply because I have so many. Um, but this little carry case it kind of made me push um, the I'll buy button. So there you go. Not too bad. And it was a very reasonable price too. So bottom tray, top tray, and a carrying case. A really, all, this kit here just is all you really need in order to teach kids tons and tons of math from kindergarten all the way to um, high school. So if you ever can get your hands on a kit like this, go for it because you will be able to do so much math with it.